In this video, I'm going to show you how to optimize your Amazon advertising and do better than the competition, whether you're into Merch by Amazon, KDP or FBA, to ultimately crush the competition and make some really good money. It's no secret that Amazon is growing tremendously year on year. In fact, in the last two years, sales generated by third party sellers on Amazon have doubled. Now with this huge growth comes opportunity that we entrepreneurs have to seize. But there's a problem when everyone is trying to seize the same opportunity. You guessed it right competition. Amazon is now more competitive than it's ever been. But should this stop you? Absolutely not. We have to find a way to crush the competition and this is what I'm going to show you shortly. One of the ways to crush the competition is running ads on Amazon. Amazon has three types of ads that you can run. Sponsored products, which is my favorite, brand ads and display ads. Being good at running ads is one of the most effective ways of being able to compete and make more money than your competition. This is because not all of them are able to run ads or run them effectively if they do. Now there's one issue. Advertising can be complex. You need to know your KPIs and look at the data and know how to interpret it. Things like your CPM, your CTR, your CVR, your ACOS and so many acronyms that I don't have time to mention. You also need to know how to bid better and how to target the right keywords, etc. So if you want to be better than your competition and make more money than your competition, you need to have a competitive advantage. And that competitive advantage can be running ads, knowing how to run ads and making money from running ads and not be afraid of trying things when most of your competitors are afraid to. The key here is looking at the data and be able to interpret it properly. And there's a really good tool that is free that can do all of this for you. Genius, right? I'm going to leave you a link down below in the description to get the tool and get your Amazon advertising stats and benchmarks for free. Then you'll already be one step ahead of the competition. This tool will basically compare your advertising stats versus the average in your category. The benchmark helps you understand the part of the performance funnel where you're good, you're bad or normal. And this in turn will help you tweak the elements that you're bad at in order to get better overall. So step one, in order to get this tool for free, go to the link in the description. It will be called Free Selix Benchmarker Tool. Click on the Analyze Your Products Now button, enter your details and on the next page, link with your Amazon advertising account. It will take up to 24 hours to analyze your products depending on how many products you've got and then you'll get an email with your report. So if we do a simple search on Amazon Easter t-shirt, you'll find a bunch of ads. One of them is this one right here. It's a sponsored ad. And as you can see, it's placed strategically to get sales. And they can afford to charge $22.99 and still make sales. That's the power of ads, guys. Scroll down, there's another ad. This is a sponsored brand's ad. And we scroll down, we see a bunch of sponsored products ads and they're all selling guys. So this is what the report looks like guys. There's a bunch of really useful benchmarks, but the one that I want to discuss today is the performance funnel and your return on investment, this part right here. So this gives you your impressions. What is an impression guys? Is every single time someone looks at this ad, they don't necessarily click on it, but they just see it or just scroll past it like this. That's an impression. And then moving on to the CTR or the click through rate. This is the percentage of clicks versus impressions. So let's say as a shopper, I'm scrolling down. Then I see this ad right here. That's an impression. Then I decide to click on it. That is a click. And your CTR is the percentage of clicks versus how many times I see the ad. And it's presented beautifully in this funnel. Now the next step is, let's say I decide to buy that product. The CVR or conversion rate is your percentage of orders from clicks. So it's beautifully presented right here in a funnel. Now moving on, your CPC. It's your cost per click. How much it costs you for each customer to click on your product. In this case, it costs us $1.1 per click. And right here is the average order value. And we get this number by dividing ad sales by the number of orders. And how do we get this ad spend number? By multiplying CPC by the number of clicks. Now, what is the ACOS? The ACOS is the percentage that it costs you to get a sale. This is how much you need to give Amazon in order to get one sale. So to get $1 in sales, you have to give them 26.7 cents. And how do we get this number? We simply divide this number by this number times 100. 
Now, each metric that is highlighted in red is a bad thing and each one highlighted in green is a good thing. Now, this basically means that our impressions have fallen by 0.7% compared to last month. Our click-through rate has fallen down by 9.3% compared to last month. And same thing here, same thing here, same thing here, and same thing right here. Now, this means that our average order value has gone up by 7.5%. Our ACOS has come down by 0.4% this is a good thing. Now our job is to know what affects these movements. How do we improve our CTR? In other words, what makes you want to click on this t-shirt right here for example? If people don't click on this t-shirt that means the t-shirt is not that great or it doesn't look good or they're not even looking for it. So the more they click on it the more it improves the CTR, the click-through rate. If they don't click on it that much then it makes the click-through rate go down which is not a good thing. Now how do we improve our conversion rate? We could improve the price, the description. There's many variables and that changes from product to product. Now, how do we improve our CPC or cost per click? Our ad needs to do well. And for our ad to do well, we need to improve our click-through rate, our CVR, our average order value. Overall, when the ad does well, the CPC is improved. And that also depends on the category. How much does it cost to advertise in that category? And naturally, as our CPC goes down and our average order value goes up, this helps the ad spend go down versus the ad sales and that improves our ACOS and this is ultimately what we're looking for. As we're going down we get a breakdown of the ACOS and what's great about this tool is that it gives you a breakdown of your product analysis. Anything that is amber is in the middle, anything that is green is really good and anything that is red is bad and this depends on your product category. This is what's amazing about this tool is that it benchmarks your stats against huge data from Amazon so you can see how you're doing versus is the competition. So the click-through rate right here is not that great. As you can see, it's on the lower spectrum. What can we do to improve this? Maybe better product imagery to entice people to click on our products. The conversion is good here. So if we improve our click-through rates, we'll be able to improve our conversion even better. And we'll even be able to improve our CPC because Amazon is going to optimize our ad even further and is going to help us with a lower CPC. They even give you a lot of information about your account structure, your keywords, your ASINs, your campaigns, your ad groups, a bunch of other metrics which you'll definitely benefit from, your ad distribution based on different ad formats, your category benchmark, and it breaks down your ads based on sponsored products and sponsored brands. Sponsored display is coming soon. And also guys, for those of you that don't have a Merch by Amazon account, or if you know someone that doesn't have a Merch by Amazon account and would like one, we've got a Merch by Amazon creation service where we can give you a working Merch by Amazon account already approved with your details. You can get the service down below in the description. I've also got you a crash course for Merch by Amazon, which you can get down below in the description and also 200 plus niches, which you can download from the description as well. I hope you found this video useful. Give this video a like, subscribe to the channel, leave me a question in the comments down below. Hit the notification bell button so that you guys can get the videos as soon as I upload them. I'll see you in the next video.